Stars of Love Island have urged the show to wake up after Mike Thalassatis was found dead. Mike Thalassatis is the second person from Love Island to have died in the past 12 months. Sophie Graydon tragically died last year, after struggling with mental health issues, while Mike's body was found in Woodland near his S home on Saturday. Today the Met Police confirmed Mike Thalassatis' body was found at a park in Edmonton, a spokesman for the police said. Police were called to a park near Latimer Way, N9 at 0928DRS on Saturday 16th of March to reports of a man found hanged. Officers in the London Ambulance Service, attended and found a man, aged in his 20s, deceased. At this early stage, the death is not being treated as suspicious. Police are in the process of informing the man's next of kin. A file will be prepared for the coroner. Now his former Love Island co-stars have now spoken out about the show's aftercare. Malin Anderson, who appeared on the second series, wrote on Twitter, Wake up Love Island. Related articles enough is enough. Nothing happened when my mom died. Nothing when Sophie died. Change needs to happen Malin Anderson I got flowers from the producers when my daughter died. No FG phone call. No support, or help. Enough is enough. Nothing happened when my mom died. Nothing when Sophie died. Change needs to happen. She was also joined in support by Jessica Shears, who wrote, Shows offer you support but realistically it's only while you are in their care. The, minute you get home and are no longer making them money it's out of sight out of mind. Shock, Mike Steff came as a shock to friends and fans. Pick, ITV, slammed, Jessica Shears also slammed the show. Pick, Twitter. There should be ongoing support and also financial advice. Life after these shows isn't all it's set up to be. Katie McDermott was another islander to come forward, writing, Hope he going forward reality shows will help more with the aftermath of being on. 1. Because I can say it definitely didn't happen after my series when lots of us needed it. People's lives change overnight and no one can be mentally prepared for it. The Good and the Bad Mike has been remembered by his co-stars and friends, with many people urging others to talk if they're struggling. Related articles Death, Sophie Graydon, from Series 2, died last year, Pic, ITV, Tribute, Mike's recent photo has been flooded with tributes, Pic, Instagram, Mike joined the series in 2017 as a late arrival, and soon got nicknamed Muggy Mike on the show. He was an outgoing character on the series, and quickly became very popular allowing him to take on extra roles outside of the show, including celebs go dating. For emotional support you can call the Samaritans 24-hour helpline on 116-123, email joe at samaritans.org, visit a Samaritans branch in person or go to the Samaritans website. ITV2 wrote in a tweet today accompanied with a picture of Mike, everyone at ITV2 and Love Island are shocked and saddened by the terrible news about Mike. Our thoughts and condolences are with his family and friends. Daily Star Online has approached ITV for comment. Related articles